I'm going to show you some footage in a moment of a man that murdered Olivia. I'm doing this because people may recognize what he's wearing. It may also help people remember seeing him in the area on the night that Olivia was murdered and thereby help us trace where he is and where he went. We can play that footage now. This footage that we're looking at at the moment shows the gunman running along Finch Lane away from Kings Heath Avenue, which is of course where Olivia lived. You then see him turn right into Berryford Road and go out of sight. We know this man is climbing through gardens and through people's backyards in order to avoid being identified as well as using the roads as you can see. You will see from the footage that the gunman is wearing a black padded jacket, a black balaclava with a peak, black gloves, and also has dark trainers with distinctive white soles. He is described as approximately five foot seven tall and of slim build. This is the man we are hunting for. We need to know where he went that night. I need to know if you saw him in the area. Remember, this was shortly after 10 p.m. on Monday, the 22nd of August. Now I know that there will be people shielding him and helping this man avoid being found by the police. If you are found doing this, then we will do everything legitimately possible to bring you to justice. It is beyond comprehension how anyone could protect or harbour a man who's responsible for killing a nine-year-old child. This man is toxic. He is toxic to our communities. And if you're protecting him, he's toxic to you and your family. I want you to place the loyalty that you have towards your family above the loyalty that you may have to this man. I want the information as to where this man is 